the back to the mission in hand. So yeah, wow. shit. Going to Colorado, going to shit, California, going to uh shit, New Mexico, fucking uh man, Phoenix, going to uh shit, so many other places I can't oh, remember. Oh, we went to Cali, I remember we went to Cali with Carolyn to do the thing with uh Locos Pero Locos, remember? Mm-hmm. My first time ever going to Cali. It, it went down. Like I, I, I was able to go in and and meet the EW Kool-Aid. You know what I'm saying? That was dope as fuck too. Like being going to the Procus Petal Loco studio and recording. So that was yeah, yeah, that was live in the motherfucker too though. Talk about that, because I know you you you're on a soundtrack and, and uh, uh with the movie Philly Bone. Oh yeah, man, I got to meet Gina Rodriguez uh when I was out there too. Like we're back in the gap, you know what I'm saying? We we actually worked on another project uh with with like a Jamaican lady or something like that that they had did uh back in the gap, you know what I'm saying? I was you know, that was my first time like dibbling dabbling into, you know what I'm saying, co writing or uh, uh ghost writing basically, you know what I'm saying? So but yeah, it was it was a uh, uh, we was all in the studio like I say shit, and they came through and she was cool. She was cool than the motherfucker. So it was it was a cool experience getting to meet her. You know what I'm saying? She she wasn't on a real Hollywood type shit. She was actually in the studio, cooling. You know what I'm saying? She was cool like shit. Then I think the next day, if I'm not mistaken, like we went uh with carolyn they went to the gym you know what i'm saying to work out type shit but okay. you know i was there but i you know i ain't i ain't wasn't working out on no shit like that you know but yeah <laughs> yeah it was cool like she just down to earth person so yeah again okay. gina rodriguez yeah you know she was, rodriguez. Cool. Yeah, yeah she was always cool yeah 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 but yeah. that movie philly brown like like she we worked on this soundtrack uh night nurse Oh, nightmare. Yeah, yeah, they, they, uh, like I say, shit, we, we, they had, they had the vibes going. The vibes was already in play. I just came in and, you know, did whatever I did to attribute to the song. And, and I was able to make it to, it was able, the soundtrack was able to make it in the movie. And, and, you know, I got my name on the critics in the movie. So, you know, you know. Yeah, that was that's a pretty cool experience. But yeah, yeah. Shout out to them boys. Yeah, yeah. So how so how was it working with E Dub and Kool Aid? Oh man, hey. Shout out to them boys. Like I say, I, I actually I feel honored because she the whole like experience, like I actually got to go and meet their family and meet their kids and like actually go to their home, you know what I'm saying? So it was like a, a real, real honor for me to be a part of that, you know what I'm saying? Because these are like well-established individuals out there in, in the radio world. So it was like, I felt like I was, I was, it, it was, it was, it was a special thing because I didn't, I felt like they didn't just let any type of person come to even into their studio for one let alone be able to come and you know be able to come to their house like that too so wow. that's that's i, I always yeah. feel honored and and you know i respect them a lot and as far as they work ethic e-dub is on another level with the engineering like his his whole sound setup with how he got the the stuff going through the wires and i, I yeah yeah it's he on another level with it so it was a <laughs> real cool experience. They hold like atmosphere. It's a, it's a it's a real dope atmosphere for creativity. And I and also shout out to uh Miko. Shout oh, out Miko. to Miko, boy Miko, that's, man. That's, uh, uh, that's, uh uh Edwards James almost son. That's his yeah, son. yeah, Miko, man. Shout out to Miko, man. He, he was cool. He, he real, real cool, man. Get on that guitar and do the food too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he was, he was, he was an active part of the Kelly experience as well. Like, like it was just like I say, it was positive vibes, good mix, good, good, good group of people. It was a dope experience. Yeah. Well, who else do you work with in Kelly? 
man, shit. Uh, we made that's like we went out there and uh, did the video with Lazy Bone, of course. You know what I'm saying? Bone Thugs and Harmony. Shout out to Lazy Bone. You know what I'm saying? One of the realest, 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 realest motherfuckers I know. Type shit. Like music aside, he's a real individual, real stand up guy. I fuck with.